Sleeping? Hi, Daddy. <laughs> you no, know, I never really looked out here. Perfect. Oh my goodness! You can yeah. see the Statue of Liberty from here. Is that cool? <laughs> yeah. Do you see the cars and the people? guys so I've been rushing getting ready and I'm so sad I forgot my false lashes and I'm like hey I want to look extra cool with my lashes but that's okay out of everything I forgot false lashes well I saw like five Sephora's in Times Square oh no so, I saw at least two maybe three okay if we're gonna so go I there I will I will stop by Sephora or if there's a Dwayne Reed around, because there's Dwayne Reeds everywhere, um, we don't have those in the West Coast, so that would be cool. Are you done with your breakfast? No, your hair is just so staticky. So I have um, a few meetings today, and then for the rest of the day, maybe we'll get to do something fun. Are you a princess? What's your name? Um, Belle. Princess Belle? Oh, oh, don't do that, Juliana. Okay, I love you. I'll see you later. Mm. Ow! <laughs> You're looking very spiffy today. I didn't even take a shower today. Oh, I love you that sweater. Yeah. From uh, Nordstrom. Maybe you know, when later. you're in New York, you just feel like you, you gotta dress up a little. Because people are walking around. It's like when you're in Italy. You know, yeah, like yeah, the yeah. waiters and the waitresses look like they walked out of magazines. Yeah, they do, Here, huh? Like, they're all wearing, they're wearing, like, their nice, pleated long sleeves and then they have like the bow tie or a necktie, right? They like, roll up their sleeves a yeah. little bit and they just look, I don't know, really they just nice. look like beautiful. But then we were surface. at the most touristy part yeah. of Italy too. Yeah. Seattle is probably the most unfashionable major city. It is. Ever. People just no. really dress No, wait, who, who is? Um, New Mexico, because remember <laughs> her friend Julie, she's like, no one ever dresses up in New Mexico. I, we've never been, but she said, I think JCPenney is like the biggest oh God, department course. store there or something like that. But yeah, Seattle is more um, like North Face and Columbia, like the sports attire. So we show up to the restaurant where we're having our meeting and there was nobody there. It turned out they were still closed, but Antonio, the I guess he's a... Uh, Owner or the manager came down and he was he was about to seat us he and everything. So confused, he's like, uh. <laughs> he's like, what are you guys doing here? Anyway, so we are 30 minutes early. I'm gonna pop into the drugstore, which I think there is one. Right oh, there? right there. Going three. Just exactly what you wanted. It's pretty cold today. I heard it's supposed to be five degrees. This is so convenient. I come in looking for nail polish. And it's the first thing I see. It's even Insta Dry. So it's in the very front, and the nail polish is super cold. It's freezing. I need to get nail polish remover. Where is it? Oh, I wonder if they have like the nail polish remover on the go. One simple trip to the drugstore turns into a shopping spree for all kinds of stuff. Honey, I thought you just needed nail stuff. Where are you gonna put that? We just got done yeah, with lunch and so CrossFit exciting. Toy We've been invited to go to so Toy Fair. Fair. So there's a Toy Fair this weekend in New York. So not only yes. is it New York Fashion Week, it is what else? The play the basketball. Oh yeah. That's NBA horrible. All -Stars. The NBA All Stars and then there's Toy Fair. So it's been yeah. crazy. Oh and, and Valentine's. Valentine's. <laughs> yeah. And there's like a record low temperatures, so there's an ice rink all across the city, <laughs> but no one's skating. It's just it's just cars sliding in. <laughs> Freezing. So anyway, I'm so excited to check out the toy fair, the toy convention. But unfortunately, I can't bring you guys in. It's some top, top secret, secret CIA agent stuff. <laughs> I'm surprised there's not like huge banners anywhere. Hey, look how fun this is. Oh my gosh, if Juliana were here, she would go crazy. I feel like I'm on the set of Friends. Or Jennifer Aniston is gonna pop out somewhere. 
This is different for a change. I'm actually doing a little bit of grocery shopping. Let's get raspberries. Me and Kira, they were devouring this. And blueberries. You know what's interesting? They don't sell wine at Whole Foods, but they sell beer. I wonder if it's a New York law or something. Because at our Whole Foods, there's like a huge wine area. There it is, Freedom Tower. Hi, what are you eating? Oh my goodness, are you eating? What? I'm done. You're all done eating? Oh my goodness, can I get a hug and kiss? Give me a kiss. How are the girls? The girls are loving this. Just sitting with Auntie Val, watching TV, eating on the floor. What they eat? What they just eat right now? Grilled cheese. And Grilled fries. cheese. JB picked cheese over berries, <laughs> which I'm actually kind of surprised about. Oh, because she had fruit earlier for breakfast. She's so. turning into a couch potato. As always, Mia's favorite tags. She loves tags. <laughs> I just found out that our second meeting today was canceled. So I get to hang out in the hotel and I actually have um, some editing to do so it all worked out perfect. Oh look at Auntie Val, you're so into it. It's so cute. You're gonna put Kira to sleep. <laughs> She's super into it too. Look how relaxed she is. I think Auntie Val and Cece are gonna go see a show within the next few days. Mm -hmm. Which show do you think you want to see? Um, I know. Well, Stacy already saw the. I think it's like Hello. a or something uh -huh. with Idina Menzel. She said that she'd see that one again, but I don't want to make her see the the one yeah. again. Yeah. So we really want to see the Carol King one. Is like that the one with Tiana Miller? Oh, that that's a different the one. That one's the cabaret one. Oh. So those are like the, our top two ones. Okay. And I mean, oh. obviously, oh. Sienna Miller's cool too, but she's yeah. not Emma Stone. <laughs> so I guess Emma Stone is on a Broadway show, and her last performance was yesterday. So. She's my favorite. Aw, oh, it's okay. So hopefully you get to see like a good so, show like, anyway. I she's so underrated as an actress, and really? I don't know why. Whenever she's on. She the talk shows, yeah. she seems so funny. She's yeah. like two celebrities really that tired. I would absolutely love to be friends with, and it's Emma Stone and Jennifer Lawrence. Because oh, I know, they, like, they, they seem both like, seem really cool. I went to college with you, like, that's what they remember. Yeah, they're just not your typical Hollywood star. Yeah. How's that in your face? Okay, it's almost nap time, and it's time for Mommy to edit. JB, she's like in a daze because it's her nap time, too. Yeah, there it goes. Awesome. I totally forgot my gloves, so I'm risking frostbite on my hand to vlog for you guys. But I'm sitting here, actually, in a very serious place. I vlogged this before, but I'm standing at one of the locations of the uh, one of the two towers of the very tragic 9/11 event, and this is a memorial. Very different from the last time I was here because there's barely one, there's barely anybody out here. But this is kind of like, I guess you could say, like a fountain, and it is right next to the Freedom Tower, which is beautiful. I'm so glad I'm here when they finally finish that. But there's two of these. There's one way over there, I believe. So brings back a lot of memories. I can still remember. The moment when I first saw everything happening on TV and I remember at school thinking I might get drafted to go off to war you know being from a military family you just automatically think okay you're gonna probably have to serve your country luckily I was not drafted but to all those men and women that went off and pursued the people responsible thank you for serving our country my ears are frozen right now. The names of the people who lost their lives are actually written here around the memorial. Ooh, ordering online. I'm using Seamless right now. Ordering food online to be delivered to us for the first time. Aliyah, thank you for the recommendation. But, uh, you know, with the girls here in the room that we have, 
we don't mind staying in if we can get delicious food delivered to us. When I didn't have kids and it was just Judy and I, it was like breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I had it all planned out. We're hitting it up, midnight snack. Now we're good with delivery. Look who woke up in awesome mood. Great All three sleep. of the girls are amazing. They had over two hours of sleep. Daddy ordered food, so we're just getting the table ready. Ooh, oh, you break dancing, Mia? Mm. <laughs> you can only have one more, and then we're gonna put it away because we're about to have our dinner. Look what you did. Oh, she did it. Yes, put away. Yeah, Seamless.com is legit. We got a whole bunch of rolls here. Uh, we've got, yeah, yeah, that's cool. We've got avocado salad. That looks awesome, actually. We've got seaweed salad. We've got spinach side dish. We've got some uh, sashimi, or no, just sushi. Some side dishes. Gyoza. There's this avocado roll slash chicken teriyaki bento box thing. Oh, of course, like edamame. California. Uh, we got some soups. We got, oh, looks like just like a side salad. Juliana, is it JB approved? Um, I don't. Yes. We're watching Big Hero 6, and I've heard a lot of great things about that movie, but I'm like starting to get so exhausted and I need to take a shower. So, while all the girls are occupied, all of them are watching except for Mia, of course. I'm going to take a shower. Is that cool with you? Hi guys. She says she wants a pink dress. Hey, what other word do you use other than no? Yes. Yes, say yes, I have a beautiful aerial dress. Bell dress. Bell dress is dirty. This one yeah, dirty. No, no, no. no, Ariel is clean dress. It's beautiful. No, no. Hey, what word do you use? Yes. Well, hello there, comment of the day. I'm gonna go to the very latest comment, and that is Hannah officially. I live in Maine. You guys should totally come to Harpswell, Maine, and see the beautiful snowy islands. I have not heard of that, but uh, let me look it up right now. Come on. Snowy Islands. Almost completely snow capped island. I know the close of Antarctica. Okay, maybe that's not the one that you're talking about. Olivia Rose. I'm sorry I haven't been watching the vlogs lately, but wasn't Judy and Benji just in NYC? Too lazy to go back and watch earlier Fox. Well, Olivia, yes. Honey, you want to say goodnight to everyone? No. Judy's loving the king size bed. Peace out. <laughs>